I am Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent example on quadratic relations application. The question here is, a large fountain located in a park has 25 water jets. One of the streams of water follow a parabolic path so that its height is given by the equation h equals to minus 2x square plus 6x plus 5 where h meters is the height of the stream of water at any distance x meters from its jet. What is the maximum distance the water jet can reach round to nearest tenth of a meter? You can always pause the video, answer the question and look into my suggestions. Now whenever you need to answer to something like this decimal values then we know we are going to use quadratic formula. Correct? So in such questions don't even try to factor. That is what I am trying to say here. Now let's sketch the scenario and try to understand this situation better. So we have a parabolic path if distance this is x and this is height both are in meters. So at height equals to 0 at, at x equals to 0 the height is 5 so let's say it starts from somewhere here and that is the parabolic path taken by the water jet. We need to find the maximum distance that is to say from here to which point right so that position we need to figure out now at this point you can say height is 0 so the formula given to us is which the model which represents the height is h equals to minus 2x square plus 6x plus 5 now if h equals to 0 then we can write this as 0 equals to minus 2x square plus 6x plus right now to find the value of x we can use the quadratic formula which is uh, let's rewrite so if we have an equation y equals to ax square plus bx plus c then the value which gives us 0 is at x equals 2 that is if I write this as equal to 0 in that case x is minus p plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a right now here a is minus 2 b is 6 and c is 5 so let's apply this formula and find x when height is 0 so x is going to be equal to minus of 6 plus minus square root of b square which is 36 minus 4 times a which is minus 2 times 5 divided by 2 times minus 2. So that gives us minus 6 plus minus square root of 36 and that can be plus minus minus becomes plus 40 divided by minus 4. So let's use calculator and find this answer. So the square root part is basically square root of 10, right? So, so you could write this as minus 6 plus minus 36 plus, okay. So square root part is 36 plus 40, which is equal to 2 square root 9, right? So we'll do 2 square root 19 over minus 4. So we have 2 square root 19. Now, distance has to be positive, right? So we'll take the negative value. So we'll take minus 6 minus 2 square root 19 divided by minus 4 as our answer, since that is going to give us the maximum distance, correct? So basically, if you take minus common, then we get, or you can also divide by 2 if you want to. So you can also get this as 3 plus square root 19 over 2, correct? 
dividing each by minus 2. So, so we'll, let's calculate this value. So it is 3 plus square root of 19, which is equal to uh, in decimals, and then divide by 2 gives us a value in decimals as 3.67. Nine, right. So, rounding this to one decimal place gives us 3.7 meters. Correct. So, so that becomes the solution for this particular case. Right.